Hello there, this is Space Star 5 and welcome to a new Let's Play series where we are playing as Bohemia and we are going to go for their new achievement that was released in 1.37, uh, the Inca, well, the Inca update, uh, along with the uh, new DLC that came out, the uh, the Winds of Change, there we go, words, words are hard, uh, where we're going for this new achievement right here as Veritas Vindic Vincent, um, which I think that's just maybe a dude's name, I don't know. Uh, starting with Bohemia, make Hussite the official face of the Empire and become the Emperor. So to do that, you have to have 80% of the Empire converted to Hussite when you go, excuse me, when the Protestant League goes ahead and wins the uh, the Religious League War. That's how we go ahead and get that going. Um, and Bohemia, oh, we also have this. Yes, it's great. Um, gives us minus 10% tax and 10% manpower reduction inside our country, which will go away once we uh, complete this one right here. Recover from the Hussite Wars, which means there's just less than 10% devastation in our entire country, uh, which is nice. But we do have a new mission tree. We have the option to go Catholic or Protestant or uh, Orthodox. No, it is Hussite. Wrong country. Or not wrong religion. Words. Blah. <laughs> <laughs> but we do have a new mission tree. Uh, we can go ahead and we can humiliate Austria. We can go ahead and merge our two vassals into one vassal into Silesia uh, by do via this event here, which is kind of cool. Or this mission, we do have the ability just to get a PU on Hungary and actually take a full state off Hungary. Oh, also one other thing to note: as part of this mission, it does make them twenty five percent cheaper to re to diplo annex. Uh, so instead of eight diplo points per development, it's only six, much like an islet. So it looks like they're kind of uh, bringing that idea a little bit more into the game. Uh, and we do have a new tag, Greater Great Moravia, uh, something that we can form after we complete all of these missions here, which is, you know, consolidate here, take a little bit of Poland, PU Hungary, Pol PU Poland, and, well, just obliterate Austria, which I'm good with, um, PU Poland area, uh, continue down Hungary and defeat the Turks, um, which basically means go conquer all the Balkans, which we'll do. Uh, we also have the PU on Brandenburg and Saxony that you can choose to do, and then you can get the Bohemian Commonwealth to get an additional modifier for Diplo Exchange, cost minus 15%, which you can stack. Um, so you can get some stupidly cheap Diplo integration where you can probably get min uh, Diplo annexation cost reduction, which is kind of cool. Um, this is, you can actually get a Prussia back in through conquering the Pomeranian Pomeranian land. Um, you just have to own the stuff yourself directly and then it gets released as a subject. Uh, I'm not sure if we'll do that, but then this is Bohemian Crystal, so we can go ahead and get faceting from our lovely little province here once we embrace the Renaissance and have a bunch of prestige. Um, nothing too much in here. This is the HRE path, which uh, we're going to have to delay until we actually go ahead and convert everyone over to Hussite. Uh, since we are going to be going Hussite for sure, we're going to go ahead and seize Crownland and see what you got here. Uh, have at least four production layer. Uh, what does this province produce? Cows? Oh, uh, eventually produce coal. Oh, actually, get subjugation of the platinum. Well, we're not going to do that. I might as well subjugate three electors, and I'll be the fourth elector, and then we're going to be golden. So I guess I'll do that for sure. Uh, why not? It's going to be more aggressive expansion. Who cares? Religious diplomats is good. Clerical education. Um, just so we can get some royal marriages a little bit easier. Do I care about any of this other stuff? Uh, what are you guys trying towards? Well, I'm going to give out military points. We also start with 35% crown, which is great. Uh, this is a lot of national manpower. I'll take that for sure. Um, supremacy with the crown. Yes. What else do we have? I would definitely want a general just because uh, it should be too hard for us to actually get this above 10% just by selling some crown land. So that's not a big deal. Uh, more... Diplo points, we'll do page for the arts because that's good. And then we'll do these last two along with something to make you a little happy or a lot happy. 10%? Yeah, free, free enterprise, that's fine. All right, so you guys trend towards 50, 55%, 70%, and 44 and a half percent. So clergy is going to be a little upset, but that's okay because we're going to go Hussite and they should be fine. Uh, and we're going to vassalize this dude because it's fun. And because I'm not going to have too much aggressive expansion here in the early game, since we're just going to PU uh, hungry. Also, this guy is really good at siege, so that's great for us. I will go ahead and grab... Uh, I want to probably build up my force. Let's also grab uh, Dead of the Burgers real quick. And Dead of the do the Burgers. Where are thou? There you are. Thank you. I desire your money. Thank you. With that. And then we're going to go ahead and grab level one dudes. Port defense is fine. I'd rather something different. I will take a Diplo rep dude for now, and I will take Prestige. I got basically no advisors I actually like. Uh, can we get a Royal Mayor here? Yes, I would like to Royal Mayor Burgundy to get the chance to get the Burgundy inheritance. Um, look, it does sound like they change it so that way if Burgundy sends you a Royal Mayor, you still have the, uh, the chance to get it. Uh, I haven't tested it myself, so I'm not going to say one way or another. And we're going to also rival Austria because we hate Austria. Um, who hates you? Poland. Poland doesn't like me, though, so we'll go ahead and ally uh, you as well. We're gonna have two. Who else doesn't like you? Burgundy, the Pope man, doesn't like you. Uh, well, he's not gonna like me either. France, you wanna be friends? Out of curiosity? Eh, probably not. Who else do I wanna be friends with? 
I mean, you rivaled me, so that's a no-go. Um, Castile and Aragon, potentially? I mean, I'll, I'll put my hat in for Aragon. If I can get it, that's great. Oh, also, we forgot to get Shrug Duchies. Shrug Duchies is kind of a, a must for us. Go. Uh, and we do have a special government mechanic where um, we have the Bohemian Elective Monarchy. Uh, so if we don't like the ruler that we get, we can kind of choose to have someone else. Give us Diplor up, extra loyalty equilibrium for our burgers or for our nobility and extra influence for the for the nobility. But it's more in equilibrium than loyalty or influence. So that's actually a good plus and plus one max privilege for the, the nobility. Uh, typically isn't super relevant for me, but hey, it's there. Uh, we're not going to convert anything because we're just going to through our interregnum. We're just going to go ahead and swap over our, uh, our religion so I don't have to convert via rebels at all. What did you just do? Okay, that's cool. Royal Bear's there, Royal Bear's there. Uh, we're all good and happy. Uh, I'm going to send some royal marriages once we're, or some more alliance offers once we're done, and hopefully some other people will. Tons of heretics. Yeah, we're gonna go for peaceful rec reconciliation between us and the Hussites, that's good to be. Uh, we're going to improve relations with both you, I will ally you, and then we are also going to look to ally you. Thank you. Who else did I royal marry? Oh, also, it's January. Could, oh, why are you allied with Bur Burgundy? He's my friend. Well, that's some shenanigans, is all I'm going to say. Oh, yeah. And Aragon will also be friends with you. Who else can I have a friend? I think that's everyone. Oh, I'm five out of six. Uh, well, it's going to be reserved for the Platinum. So we're going to awkwardly look at that, and we're going to we're gonna attack them when we go ahead and attack these these fools. Um, OK, uh, Poland got their personal union on Lithuania, which is great. Uh, I want to go ahead and start working down this mission tree here and here. So getting you guys up to 200 pinion is going to be something we're going to rush for, um, just so you guys form one one state. And so I have a spare relationship slot, and I wish to humiliate you. You are friends with lots of dudes. Uh, but once Burgundy is able to join, we'll be okay. So we're going to have to wait a little while. That's fine. Not the biggest deal in the world. And we're chill. Also, that means I could probably go ahead and have another friend, which isn't you. Who doesn't like you? Wait, you want an independent? No, you don't want me to support your independence? Never mind. Not really surprised by that, be honest. I could be friends with you, but we're probably going to end up killing you, so I'm not really uh, uh, too uh, just too enthusiastic about that. We have a 053. Oh, it's of Aragon's dynasty. Hmm, that's very interesting. I shall elect him. I would definitely prefer admin points. Also, we're going to focus on military points early game. I would love... Oh, actually, careful is kind of nice. It's not the worst thing in the world. Uh, do we lose all of our royal marriages? No. Okay, cool. What do we complete? Oh, control the electors. Yeah. Uh, additional trust and approve relations for each of the electors. Who's voting for me? Why? I mean, I'm definitely not going to complain about that. That's also why am I voting for Austria? Hold up. Vote for myself is definitely the thing. Okay, so actually we'll become the emperor right now. Do you not have an heir? No, you do. Mm, cool. Well, I guess I'll take this click. That additional trust with all the electors is kind of nice. I'm not going to complain about that. And plus, some diplo relation is also nice. Uh, we're just going to improve relations with you uh, prior to the war, because uh, that's not going to be the worst thing in the world. Also, I think we're going to dow on you. Yeah, we're going to dow on you, so that way... Um, was there true up? 49. Okay, we're going to dow on Hungary so we can break all of Austria's alliances, and we can also melee him as part of that war. Um, that worked for me. You're happy with us? Why don't we go build a spanner? Actually, no, I guess I'll build a spanner on you, Austria, since you're the, you have the fort that it's going to be super annoying versus Pest, which is only level one. Oh, it's very quick. Uh, yes, we are indeed going to elect him. Uh, he is scripted, so we're very enthusiastic to have him. Uh, we did just go ahead and flip Hussite, so our vassals are going to be a little little upsetty spaghetti with us, which is fine. Uh, it's not the biggest deal in the world. I guess I'll come back from you real quick, because I need to send more royal marriages, uh, since we do lose all of them. Send a royal marriage to you. There you go. And we're going to continue improving with those guys. Didn't I have a royal marriage with you? I could have sworn I did. Maybe I did. Who knows? A royal marriage with you. What else did we complete? And the Regency. Make sure I made this reduction? Sure. And we're also going to go ahead and start converting our own land. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and flip on the horse for the Shunity. We're currently losing money. That's okay. We don't really care about money. Money is temporary. Yeah, we can lose a little bit. That's fine. Lose stab. Oh, lose gum reform rights. That's fine. It's not the biggest deal in the world. You guys need like an extra hundred opinion. Did you end up going to? Uh, you went with no one. Well, that's cool. Well, you're definitely going to die, so I wish you luck. <laughs> Great bullying famine. You do that. Yeah, I don't care what Bohemia's opinion for me is. 
Uh, and you just died with no legal heir on your death. Um, though one of our dynasties sounds. That kind of sucks. Oh well. Life goes on. Uh, let's go ahead and merge these two armies and get you guys together. Not the biggest deal in the world. They are 50. So I guess something could happen. Um, Burgundy, we are allied, right? Yeah. You're allied. You're allied. Also, you need more opinion because we're a different religion now. We're chill. We're not really going to expand here early game. We're just going to personal union people and call it good. Could enforce your religion, but it's only plus 50. And the relative power against us is too strong. Oh, with your 7,000 dudes. I really do like the fact that you guys are standing next to each other. It makes you guys look cute. Um, that you guys think that you can stand strong together against us. The powerful and mighty Bohemia. Also, our truce with you is almost up. What is the requirement for us to... What is this? No, work harder. Uh, the only requirement missing is for the event to fire, or at least 1457. I don't know what the Matthias uh, Corvia... Corvinus is? I don't know what that is, so I'm intrigued. Um, also, where else? What, what else in here needs to be converted? This? Convert it? I go. So I will be devving that province soon, anyways. Because uh, I think I'm going to delay Diplotech and just dev more in the gold mine and here for faceting. Uh, it's going to piss off the burgers, or I can lose a little bit of money. A little bit of money sounds like a fair price to pay. You guys are at 63 opinion, not terrible. Burgundy has already died, so we're definitely. The Burgundy adherence is definitely going to fire. I might as well improve relations with him while we wait. And we're going to dow on you when we call the Burgundy into another fight. So how many fairies do I have with you? Uh, it will be enough when we go ahead and fight Hungary, probably. Should be enough. What is this? Oh, it's tech. The other tech? Yes, I would be picking that. Because now we're super strong. Um, and it's not an issue. I guess I'll come back from you. You're happy enough. And it's only you and Austria versus pretty much everyone else. Which I would appreciate. I will extend all my loans. I think someone else is going to pay for them. It's kind of my hope. And Brandenburg and Burgundy will both join, which is beautiful. Stack like those guys, and we're going to go ahead and pay for our army. And we're going to doubt. Once we have just a little bit more morale. Take a little step back. Brandenburg, come on back. Yes, we humiliate you. That's fine. We could wait another five years, but we're just going to do humiliate CB. We're going to end up wait piecing a hungry or taking money from him. I'm not sure which we're going to do just yet. Uh, but this war is purely for beating up Austria. Oh, yeah. Yes, consolidate. Thank you. Uh, makes my life easier. Oh, so you ended up going... Okay, well, you also named Tech Swap, so that's cool. You special vassal? You're an incorporated vassal. Very nice. I like seeing that. And what else do we get? Diplomatic sanction minus 5% until the end of the game. And Gup Cap increased as well. And we... Wow, we instantly... Oh, we instantly get a personal union CB on you. Oh, that's strong. Due to our country... I didn't... I didn't Tech Swap. They did. Because I lost my subject and he was brought back, I lost strong duchies. That's interesting, but I'm still at 4-4. Four to four. Oh, sorry, Hungry. I didn't actually... Oh, there's too many dudes here now. I didn't actually want to fight this entire army. Wah, retreat. Oh, we killed more than we lost at the end of the day. That's all we asked for. Go beat up Hungry. That's fine. Like this. I mean, I might as well go ahead and vassalize the platinum over here. Yep, Hungry, I wish to fight your army. Are right, there so many dudes here. Okay, well, you guys are just going to move faster than me, so I guess that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and stand in Luxembourg so I can walk back and over into the Platinich. Uh When I go ahead and down on this guy. This Diplotech. Uh, yes, I'm going to end up taking it. I like my uh, my stuff. All right, so... Ah, uh, because I'm at war with the Emperor. All right, so we need to peace out Austria first. Hold up. We can do that. Wasn't exactly on the, the list of things I wanted to do, but that's okay. With that province, and we're coming on back. Because we forgot about the whole HRA thing being a thing. I do also want to create more papers with you. Do, do, do. Influence, there you go. Great papers, there you go. Enjoy. We're gonna come over here and slap all of Austria. Goodbye. It's a nice little stack wipe. And I guess we're just gonna go to the Austrian capital. And uh, siege it down. And call it good. Because we do have three siege pit leader. Uh, it's not gonna be an issue. And no one's sieged down any of my land. Our uh, devastation is ticking away very nicely. Uh, it's a little bit there, just because it's not adjacent to a fort. And we can uh, do a little bit of devving for that. So. Not the biggest deal in the world. Uh, we'll go for National Manpower Modifier. So we can sit here with a death stack and be fine. I'll lose Prestige. Not that I want to lose Prestige, but it's fine. Three one two is very mediocre. I may go ahead and disinherit him. 
I get a claim on arrival. I get a claim on Austria. Well, I'm not going to take anything from Austria in this war, so. Renaissance is a thing. Uh, we appreciate that. Who else wants in? Aragon wants in. Uh, I don't need you in this war, unfortunately, my friend. But actually, I will use you against uh, Poland, because we're probably going to try and PU him right, right after this as well. Um, prevent the Teutons from dying and just letting Danzig spawn. Also, your army literally just got obliterated right there. It was very, very cute to see. Uh, am I going to lose this? I did lose that siege race. That's amazing, given the fact that I have a three siege leader and you didn't. So you had a one. Yeah, you shouldn't have been able to take that. I'm very annoyed. Yeah, it was over a year for that siege. Shenanigans, garbage, all of the above. Half price tier three advisor. I won't be able to afford him, so I'm just going to take that for now. If I can, I would assault this. Unfortunately, I can't. So, all right, we're good here. Uh, Polish diplomacy, we're going to take that up in just a second. Might as well start improving with you because you're going to be unhappy with me anyways. The same with you. All right, so we've converted our province. Wonderful, beautiful. Uh, let's go ahead and convert some more territory. Uh, where does this do? Okay, here. Great. Missionary strength. There you go. Enjoy. And we took that siege back. Fantastic. Uh, why don't we go say siege this down? Since we can go ahead and flip it up an extra 21% just for standing there. And then we'll go to pest. Since that's the goal. If possible, I do want to go ahead and humiliate Austria. I also don't really have any dudes, so if I can, I'm definitely going to humiliate. I wish to go ahead and take warps from you. And can I annul some of your lines? Who are you actually really friends with? Uh, Hungary's not going to... Well, Hungary will still be around. So if I can, I'm going to also break your alliance with Hungary. Um, so I can get basically uh, white peace with Hungary and call it good. Austria is doing A-OK -okay over there. Carl dies. Do I care about Carl? No, I don't. Oh, wait, who? No, I care about Carl. Carl can't die. Yeah, we just have national unrest. That's fine. Carl's too important. I, I think it's Krail, uh, not Carl, but hey, it's Carl for me. <laughs> All right, you are here. I would also, I'm getting warps. I'm going to take more of your money. Thank you. Goodbye. I don't really care about your friends because uh, Bohemia's not, or Hungary's not going to have any friends after this. You've been humiliated. That lets us complete our objective for prestige um, and diplo relations. Uh, to complete the mission while he made it in Austria, we get 25 prestige. Oh, so we get even more prestige, yes. By all means, give me, let me stack all the prestige. We're not gonna take any of this land, I don't need to, uh, as part of this. Also, can I just attack the planet? Because you're within the empire and Bernie won't defend you. Uh, that's gonna be kind of a difficult subjugation. Maybe I go ahead and call them all into this war here against the, the poles, and we'll go from there. Line up on the coast. You. Know your alliance with Austria. And yeah, just give me money, that's fine. I don't need that truce to be any longer. We're just taking money so I can pay off my debt. Interesting. Okay, well, we'll just wait on that. We're just going to go ahead and PU this guy. Yes, we have the restored... You know, oh, Burgundy doesn't want to join? Distant war. It's a distant war for you. I call shenanigans, uh, but Brandenburg not joining is kind of nice. Four exhaustion, and they like us. All that seems fair. It's a relatively even troop count. We can go to step on his capital. We did bring Aragon in, who's going to take a little while to get here, so that's okay. Uh, we're also still a military tech ahead of him, which is also very nice. Also, I will probably end up hiring entire mercs. May attach to me. Be supportive. Get over here. No, that, that's definitely not what you do. That's how you die. <laughs> that's definitely how you die. Uh, I will ask for military access through you, because I don't know if... Aragon's even going to be able to get over here. Granted, they don't actually have that many dudes looking at that. I have the majority of the army at this point, and I don't have the ability to hire dudes, so we're going to have to hire some mercs. Do I have any prof... Oh, yeah, we're just going to burn that, because I don't need professionals for anything. I don't think I need it for it. Why are you doing this? Why are you killing yourself? Silesia, just don't stand there. You'll be fine. You're on being supportive, not suicide, but you've definitely only committed, like, suicide in Spooku. All right, so we can go fight here, because you're still tech behind, yeah. Both tech behind. We have the war goal now. Um, you should attach to me. And this, oh, this grassland. It's not the best place for us to fight, but it's a place. They lost more than we did, and that's all that matters. Um, we obviously have the war goal at this point, and I want the other province in here that still needs to be converted. This one right here. Right there. There you go. A little bit of unrest. That's okay. Someone else will deal with it. There we go. Uh, Aragon, I don't see your army over here. Do you want to give me access? May that gives Aragon all the way up to here. 
I can't get it to the rest of them, but it's a starting place. Bolts and prot. Well, I think Hungry or Poland may deal with them. Or we can go stack like Poland. But also not mine. Nah, yeah, you guys better flee, you cowards. Very used to a cowardly Poland. Get sit on that. See if they'll go and occupy that for us. That was four defensive reduction. That kind of sucks. Oh, but we can get discipline even better. It's definitely better. There we go. And no one's even here. I uh, will be able to take this siege here fairly soon. Uh, why am I taking it? Because of attrition? Yeah, for attrition. That's okay. I'll take the end points. Thank you. And I could get war score cost against other religions. Uh, it's kind of nice. Plus minus 10%. Does that make it cheaper for us to PU? I don't think so. 60%. Actually, let's do a little bit of science. Does it make it cheaper? I don't think it does. Yeah, it doesn't. Okay, cool. That's what I thought. Science is proven. I will extend all my bones, because that's just a thing, and we're going to take this, and we're going to go fight. Are you combat leader? Mm, not really. You're, you're better, but not by much. I don't know. Give me more rebels. That's fine. I'll kill them. Also, that 30k stack is kind of annoying. All right, let's go kill those guys. You guys are set to be supporting our military tech five to your three now. We're actually going to upgrade our unit types over here. Because they're not going to come fight me. You're going to leave me alone while I go ahead and do this. Uh, which is good for me because now I have an additional... I have better units now. What is this? Uh, this is for P on hunger. We're going to wait on that though. How long does this last for? For 25 years? Okay, yeah, we'll take that for now. I will push that any time. I will go ahead and defend our land. And I'm very tempted to hire mercs now. Just for more but What is this? Interesting song. Very interesting. Uh, distant War minus 44. Really? I don't think it's that distant for you. What is this song? It's new. It's definitely part of the... Uh, the... Winds of Time achievement, or uh, DLC, for sure. Definitely different, though. Also, we're just going to hire these guys. I don't care about money. Money doesn't matter. We're going to have a bunch of subjects. We're going to be so strong, it doesn't matter. Uh, we're going to give you the combat leader. We're going to have you attach that army, and we're going to go hit this army instead. Uh, just because it's, well, it's had more pro siege progress than the other one. So you can hit this the 6k stack. No one's going to bother reinforcing. Uh, we can go hit Lithuania stack. No one's going to reinforce once more. Uh, now you only have 14k stacks. So we're going to hit that. So we're just, yeah, we're just going to systematically destroy every army. That's great. Goodbye, Celia. Uh, now we'll go ahead and hit this stack. Our dudes are, are tired from fighting, but it doesn't matter. There we go. Good. How's this stuff? All right, this army is, like, devastated right now. It's like, we don't know what's going on anymore. We're all dead. Uh, but it's fine. All right, so this state no longer needs that. You guys go ahead and swap to Enforce Relish Unity, and you're golden. We've almost converted all of our land. We're not going to take any land for ourselves as part of this. Uh, just more personal unions and money. Which I'm a okay with. Uh, let's go on this level 1 fort for ourselves. Because more wars. For some reason, vassal forts are worth more than your forts. Be just because it's per based on relative percentage of each person. Uh, which I think is shenanigans. But hey, it is what it is. I will take this and this. Got time for both of those. Uh, not the biggest deal in the world. Oh, you're also fighting the Teutons? Did you dow on them? Okay, well, we're going to end up fighting you after this, so that's fine. Uh, that'll be interesting. We're going to force you to give me a bunch of money. I kind of like that. What are you at? Minus a bunch of reasons. Only Poland and Hungary are in the personal union, which, or uh, are in the coalition, which is fine. Matters not, we took a loan a will. Good job, Silesia, beating up uh, Silly. Uh, and we lost our three seats there. That sucks. Get over there, then. Attach that army, and you guys are gonna go wipe this guy, these guys out. Restab, don't mind if I do. 55% should be enough. It is. And money, because I need money. Oh no, I'm being attacked. Help. The Teutons have decided to, uh, you know, to, to attack our, our, level, our loyal subject. What are we ever going to do? Okay, I'm gonna go home. <laughs> Poland's no longer considered a great power. That's because we're the great power. Surprise! Uh, I'm gonna improve relations with both of you guys. You guys are gonna be a little upset with us for a little while because I did go ahead and forcibly vassalize you, or subjugate you rather. We're going to delete this army because I don't need that anymore. You guys leave us alone and we go home. 
Must be an awesome run. That's cool. You can do that. Also, I need strong dungeons, because I can have that again. Because I have more than two subjects. Sorry, strong dungeons. Take that. We're good. We're golden. What do I need for this? Oh, platinum still needs to become a subject. Could do that. I think I'm going to wait. Base production sounds great. I need. I kind of need more than ten thousand dudes. To be honest, our manpower is a little drained at the moment. Are we still uh, burning it away? No, we have no more left to burn. It has felt it already. The burn has been felt. Also, who are you allied with? Why are you? Oh, did you oh, you really called in all your friends. That's cool. I do not wish to participate or partake in this. Other than the fact that my military is stronger than everyone, and I have to. What is this? Oh, here we go. Uh, what is this? Complete the Polish diplomacy. 20 provinces. All of ours. Yes. I get permanent claims on all of the two tops. Very nice. So maybe we'll go ahead and uh, get a Danzig going. Be kind of interesting. What else do we complete? Recover from the Hanseatic. Yes, I do want that indeed. Uh, National Arrest taxes will be good. Hussite destruction will be removed from us. This is great. Definitely. I need to dab with these. We're going to use Diplo points for this, though. Uh, we're going to encourage development. I need money anyway, so we're going to do a couple there and a couple there. There you go. Spent all our Diplo points. Very easy. Is this your capital? No, it's not your capital. Okay, cool. I have zero manpower. I'm very tempted to go quantity very early on because we already have no dudes. What is this? Advisor cost, monthly favor gain, modifier, or nobility max privilege. I don't need more nobility max privilege at all. Cap cost, do the arm tradition do? No. National taxes, kind of tempting. Actually, very tempting. More money, sounds great. Less influence means more crown land when we conquer land. Not that I've conquered anything yet, but yeah. More taxes sounds great. Pay me. Uh, we are going to continue to convert this area, because we're already converting in that state. Uh, and all of you guys are sieging away. I will repay my loan, thank you. Loans have been repaid. I don't have any forts or any coastal territory, so anything that you say about that is a lie. I love that all of our dudes are here, which is also very nice. We can have another thing. Hmm. Don't need harsh treatment. Could go for stab cost reduction. Don't really need it, though. Um, tolerance, religious unity, plus 10%. Uh, unfortunately, it isn't based off religious unity. It is just based off of... Uh... That's conquering land. That's recover. We'll get that as part of that. This one. All provinces need to be converted. That's right. Okay, cool. All right, yeah, it's not based on religion, so that doesn't matter. Other than the stab, first stab cost. So let's just look for really arm attrition decay. Um, so we can keep our arm attrition nice and high so I can get better leaders. Uh, all that sounds great. Uh, two times, I think we're just going to make white peace. Or maybe we're going to have annul your alliance with uh, Denmark because they're annoying. Can build a building. Temple for 0.26. Yep, we're definitely going to build that. That is a significant amount of income for us. All right, you're almost happy. You're almost happy. I'm going to need some dudes from you at some point. Oh, actually, you're out of manpower. Never mind. Never mind. Who's just let out? Uh, only Lithuania. Why? I didn't enforce my religion, or didn't enforce you to force you to be converted. Wish to just stack white batch. Do not attach to me. Just continue to occupy. Be happy. Please, okay, I was like, please leave me alone. I do not wish to actually sit here. Two times you're going to get fully occupied. Brandenburg, you're a little occupied. You did buy the the two provinces off them. I would definitely take that for sure. Uh, that is a great event. I'll take that. That's fine. And I need to convert this province, actually. Before we go ahead and convert the other one, which is, of course, Julie, and we'll go from there. Manpower is slowly going to reinforce. Take 18 ducats. Sure. I mean, that's like nine months or eight months worth of income, so I'm good with that. This is still high. It's very high. Um, but I don't have any rebels inside my country. So it's not that big of a deal. Because produced my manpower recovery speed kind of sucks. Uh, as a reduction for those, but oh well. Burgundy pieced out. Burgundy paid 14 ducats. Mm, wow, that's uh, so much. Annul your alliance with Denmark and then give me warps. And money. There you go. Goodbye. How dare you declare on me? Everyone's loyal, which is also very nice. We can go ahead and rival the Muscovy since you decide to rival me, and I would like to go ahead and seize Crownland as well. Can't just do it just yet. Platinum needs to be subject. Look, that one's uh, that one's a bit difficult right now. I gotta wait. Gotta wait a little bit. Uh, we're gonna recall from you, Lithuania. You're happy enough. 
Uh, trust can be a little bit higher. Why don't we curry favors with you? Just so I can get that up nice and high. You are already loyal as well, or at least happy with me. You're going to be capped here soon. You are capped as well in terms of uh, you liking me right now. Uh, you can't give me sub soldiers or ducats, so all of that's bad. We're also going to curry favors with you, which is going up very quickly uh, with both these guys. Uh, military power relative to us is still relatively high, which kind of sucks. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and seize. They don't care that I'm going to get some hot site rebels. We're just going to kill them off. They're not going to do anything anyways because it's adjacent to a port. And we're going to be golden. I think we're going to go ahead. Oh, yes. I will continue to extend my loans. It sucks for inflation, but I, I kind of need an army. Uh, I think we're going to go ahead and head to guys drill as well. Make enough money. Diplo points for gold mine? I think so. Uh, you need just a little bit. Two, two, one, two. And then I need to dev this one last province over here. To go ahead. Not that one. Not that one. We're going to work on that one. Uh, this is, wait. Okay, that one we need to dev for. Shadow Kingdom. I don't care what happens in the Shadow Kingdom. Does not matter. <laughs> have at least 25,000 troops and no country have more development than us. Who currently has more development than us? Oh, Austria does. Okay, so we just have to, like, destroy Austria. Which I'm fine with. I have no qualms about that. And we just need to go ahead and brace the Renaissance and we can spawn fasting because we have plenty of, uh, prestige not a big deal we've converted our last province that we needed so we're going to go ahead and convert our last province inside our country and we're going to go ahead and get our center of reformation right yeah it's a center of reformation for 100 years don't mind if i do we're golden um subjects all of you can be siege focused we're just going to chill for a little bit for money don't mind if i do uh because that means more temples uh, a little bit more and how about a little bit extra trade there we go there we go that will work. Manpower is still very, very bad, but that'll recover with time. And we're just waiting for our tr Oh, you're allied with France. At least we have a Burgundy in the way, but that's pretty bad. He's also sent me 870 dudes so I can send them straight to the front. Thank you. Uh, you are allied with Muscovy as well. How annoying. Oh, well, life goes on. I think they have points. Did you end up getting an air? Yeah, you have Philip on the throne. Very nice. Or Charles is already on the throne. So you are going to die and have, have the Burgundian Herod's proc, but it'll be interesting. All right, but that is all the time that I have for today. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you guys please like and subscribe, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day.